connects rifle. Connects semi-automatic pistol. Connects semi-auto rifle. Connects shotgun style thing. Shoots spinning bullets. Spinning yellow connectors. And the connects the Lego rifle. Doesn't really do much, but it can shoot if need if need be. Okay. First up, Lego rifle. Pretty good. Long. Really good long range. Really, really accurate. It ooh, if I could get the real colors it would be better, but First up, Lego rifle. There you go. Long barrel. Good stock. Semi automatic pistol. Style. Trigger. Gear spin. One about a half revolution of the inside gear. And that's pretty much it. Uh, oh yeah. It can sh it shoots these big rubber bands stretching from the tip of the actual gun down to the middle gear and this thing has good accuracy okay next up connects rifle same length as the other rifle Lego rifle Approximately same rate of fire, except you have to reload this one every time, which is a pain. But it's got a magazine that just looks cool. I put that on there just for fun. Uh, trigger, pretty simple. Holds a green thing on this black, on the black spin that pulls a band, and you pull the trigger. It's free to spin. So you can load it on your shoulder, like this, fire, 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 or just sweep. Shotgun. It's not really much of a shotgun, it's just track made out of yellow pieces put together side to side. If you look up on the top, the rubber band passes underneath a blue bar, which then goes to the spin. The yellow piece is loaded into that and clicked back. Does a sad click button. Then, when you pull the thing, the connects piece is released spinning. Watch. Very accurate. Look at the mark. See that? Do you see that mark in the wall from that connects piece? That's crazy. That's dangerous.